The Cleveland Auto Show continues today at the IAC Center. And for more than a century, the event has seen lots of changes, and the once futuristic features on display are now more standard in most vehicles. Those advances will only come more rapidly in the years to come. So News 5's John Kosick asks what the auto show might look like a decade from now. The Cleveland Auto Show often offers a glimpse into the future, but the reality is it's tough to differentiate this video from 10 years ago this week, the 2010 Cleveland Auto Show, with today. A decade from now, that won't be the case. To be sure, the headline that cars will change more in the next decade than they have in the past century is a bold one, but those in the auto industry say, just wait. It's going to open a whole world of, uh, of change for us. Brian Swanson is chief engineer of the new Pacifica. I think the next 10 years is going to be amazing from the standpoint of the technology that we see in cars today versus what we're going to see just over even probably the next five years. One difference is evident on the new Ford Mustang Mach-E, which sports a frunk or front trunk. All electric vehicles no longer need large air intakes in the front to cool the old combustion engines opening up a world of design potential. And this particular frunk, as we like to say, actually has a drain in the center of it. So if you're tailgating out at a Browns game, for example, um, fill it up with ice and it'll, it'll drain right out. Other changes will be the internal amenities that both technology and the gradual move to more and more autonomous features will allow. Kind of one of those things what I tell everybody is everything will change, but not in the way you think it's going to. So it'll be fun to kind of watch the journey happen. A journey you'll see in real time each year over the next decade at the Auto Show, brought to you by names you may not even yet know. Your auto shows should still be pretty interesting because it's just going to basically showing off that who's really the future thinkers for the tomorrow. And you're going to see some cool stuff. At the Auto Show, John Kasich, News 5.